What's next for you? What's next for you? This is what's next one. I'm gonna give you a view. What's next for you? What's next for you? This is what's next one. I'm gonna give you a view. We start this review off a little different because I feel like this right here go along with the review. I'm not just only out here to do the review. I'm out here actually to do some hiking, you know, checking out New Mexico, Albuquerque, checking out this canyon right here. And uh, actually, I'll show you when I get back to the front. It's a scary part about being out here for a lot of people, even myself. So I'll tell you one thing. Just make sure you watch your step. And stay on the path. Because most of the time they're out there just hiding. Probably looking at me right now. But you stay on this path, you shouldn't have really... No problem. And I'll tell you one more other thing. They will give you a warning before you see them. But I'll show you that sign once I'm finished up. This is nice. There's the other mountains all the way on that side with the snow on it. We definitely got to check that out. Not today, though. So, yeah. I'm thinking I'm getting to the halfway mark. Because it's turning. I'm going to keep on pushing. I'll let you know by the end of the video how many miles. Well, it's two point, I think two miles or something like that. It's on the sign back there. I'll get it for you. And what you call it? Um, it's 2.2 .2 miles. Mm, I think it's going to take me a total. Probably an hour and a half. Maybe longer. Just because I'm just enjoying the view. I'm not really pushing it. Now to try to do it no faster really. Just going at a nice tempo and join what my eyes is laying on right now, you know, and what y'all laying your eyes on right now, you know, yeah. I'm going to keep on moving, show you the next sign want to give me that mileage mark and everything, and Basically, we're going down right now it is. Two point two miles. Yeah. That was a nice walk. Yeah. Get close to the whole bottom about that loop. So if that's 2.2, .2, this is probably 0.3. This is probably all I get the 2.5, 2.6. Walking from the parking lot up on the trail, going to that sign. But yeah, we're getting close to the park, and I'm gonna show you the poster. And then we going straight dive into the review. Yeah. 
that was nice. You know, love being out in nature. Just get away from the city. Granted, it's a, it's a heavy traffic road right here. You probably can hear the cars. But, it doesn't really matter because once you start walking back up and near, it goes in the dips and everything. And at a point, I didn't really hear none of the cars or at all. So, yeah. It's nice, close to over here. It don't look too far from downtown. And let's go ahead and hop in this review. I don't know if you guess it, but you guess it right if you did guess rattlesnakes. Did not hear no rattle. But most likely they're a lot more deep up in there compared to what's the trail been and everything. So yeah. And if they is close enough to the trail, they'll probably duck off. We're back with another review yeah and before this review let's take a little hike to go along with the theme of the mountain house yeah 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 welcome back to what's next one you know it we back finally but i review another review another review if your first time on this channel of what's next one make sure you go check out the other review you have it in the playlist if you here for the review and there's some traveling some cooking but this right here is more like this right here mountain house adventures we at the mountains today taking a hike so before we get into this i'm gonna let y'all come with me on a hike around this area let's get into it that was amazing hike you know that was amazing it's nice i hope y'all enjoy it you saw the crazy part at it when you saw the animal was a rattlesnake so here we go got our mountain house open this up Make sure you put the trash in your pocket so you can put it in the trash later. Didn't ball in the water, but went to the store before I actually came here to take the hike. And I know I was about to make this after. And a plane going across. That looks really good. It's chicken and dumplings. So you can see the dumplings. Got a little chicken in there. Got sweet peas. Yeah, that looks good. It's cold. Let's go ahead and put the hot water in there. That should be enough. This actually was made in Oregon. Oregon, Oregon, Oregon. Oh crap. If you was tuning in on my page, you know I was staying out in Oregon before I actually hit the road. Probably was way too much water in there. But it's all good. Got chicken, the sauce, non fat, dairy, milk, cornstarch, chicken flavor, cooked ground chicken. Uh, we got some sea salt flavor, onion powder, with some jute salt. 
potatoes, flour, carrots, turmeric, a turmeric in there, cane sugar in here, got a cane sugar in here, it's crazy, get a milk in a week, so if you don't like milk, or you can't drink milk, or if you don't like wheat, you don't like wheat, it's probably ain't for me. So we're gonna let this cook up for about a couple minutes. I'm gonna get back to you. So if you check out the other videos that's on this page, or if you already been with me this whole time, you would have know I dropped uh, one other review with the mountain house. Then it was the lasagna and meat sauce. That was in a whole nother area, particularly in Colorado. Uh, felt way different about it. And I did something in that video I didn't do in this video. In this video, I did something I didn't do in the other video. So you gotta go watch it, check out. See, I feel like it's done. It'll be sitting here for like about five minutes. Oh, that looks good. That looks good. Chicken and dumplings. Yeah. Should have had a spoon instead. Got a little plastic fork, but it's all good. For it to be dry, frozen. It's really good. Chicken and dumplings. Feel like. Well, if you just out there backpacking, just hiking a little further away from the city and everything, and you got this, this is perfect. You get good flavor out of it. But, other thing I feel about. You just need a little bit more seasoning. A little more garlic or a little more salt. Well, not really salt. A little pepper. A little paprika. For the most part, it's good. Like an herb. You need some more herbs in it, too. You know, like an herb flavor garlic and herbs or something like that. Yep. Actually, it's another company. I can't remember the name of it, but I'm going to do the next video I make with this Mountain House Adventure Meals. I'm going to make with the uh, uh, seeing which one is the best between the dry frozen being next to the city I know you're here all that stuff but I'm about to enjoy the rest of this and I hope y'all enjoyed the video more many more videos to come I'm loading them up recording mostly everything and yeah Make sure you subscribe if you want to. It would be very, very nice. Thank you. Just went into Krispy Kreme. Got me a donut. So, yeah. 
one of the Krispy Kreme. About to wrap the day up at uh, Walmart is across the street. I gotta go to Walmart to get some few. And uh, probably just gonna cook me some ramen tonight, something simple and everything. Got the cream foam with the chocolate on top. Usually I like the uh, um, the Oreo one, but the, uh, the lady in there said they didn't have that one for about a year. That's crazy. Really, I want that one, but. Yeah, just amazing. Well, go ahead, wrap this video up with this. Got a lot more to come. I would be in New Mexico, Albuquerque, all over New Mexico. There's not one spot I'm going to be at. And just enjoying it. I'm trying to make something work by next year, but that's that's what work behind the scenes on. And if it comes to light, I will definitely bring y'all along on how I made it happen. Until then, we're gonna keep on enjoying the road. You know? And it's like the intro say. What's next for you? What's what's next for y'all? Leave in the comments what's next for y'all. What what you got uh like what are you gonna do for Christmas? What are you cooking up for Christmas? Are you gonna make the same thing you made for Thanksgiving? Or are you gonna mix it up? I got a, a good meal. I'm about to make this Thanksgiving. I'm gonna drop it on on here so y'all can see what I put together. What's next for you? What's next for you? This is what's next one. I'm gonna give you a view. What's next for you? What's next for you? This is what's next one. I'm gonna give you a view.